welcome back to my channel. <sighs> As a law student again, I am currently in my philosophy of law class. Um, my professor just announced my grade. I passed the midterms, but I got a low grade, girl. And I don't know how that happened. Kasi inifortan ko naman siya. Nagpapasa naman ako ng ano, magandang papel. I don't know how that happened. I'm just waiting for this class to end. Kasi ako eh nag pa for consti and for cream. No? Kasi medj yun ang pangit ang standing ko. Hirap na hirap akong balansehin ang work at law school especially demanding yung uh, work. May iba akong classmates na medyo okay yung uh, standing nila kasi medyo mataas na sila sa work nila. Mandedelegate na nila yung task but ako na nasa pinakababa pa lang ng hagdan wala pa akong naaakyat ako yung tumatanggap ng delegated task. So, medyo nasa akin ang workload. Nasa akin ang mga sulatian, kailangan ng time para mabuo yung mga papeles. Ayun! Ayan, dyan na yung prok ko. Anyway, look at this. Look at my case. Girls can do anything. Divine, may M, may M pa dito. Divine Feminine. Hmm, ganda diba? Ang pangit lang nito. Chalky. Anyway, bye. Nagkasalita na kasi yung prof. So, these are established principles or propositions on which law is built. Uh, the maxims are time-tested and are an ancient treasure of Roman laws. It's the ancient Romans that turned their civil actions into uh, legal maxims which crystallize with its um, laconism a thousand past experiences in humanity's quest for what is just and right. It is also proverbial because Romans believe that what is legal must be moral and it imposes majesty and command because it has the um, elements of what law should be crisp and clear. So, for continuation, the new civil code first is ignorantia leis neminem excusat, which means ignorance of the law does not excuse. In Article 3, ignorance of the law excuses no one from compliance therewith. Next is, in pare delicto potior est condicio defendatis, which um, means where both parties are at fault, the condition of the defendant is better. Um, it was adapted by Article 1192, which states, in case both parties have committed a breach of the obligation, the liability of the first infractor shall be equitably tempered by the courts. If it cannot be determined which of the parties first violated the contract, the same shall be deemed extinguished, and each shall bear his own damages. Good morning! I'm about to start my class. It's a uh, Saturday. I have two classes, Criminal Law and Constitutional Law. May recitation ako pareho and pareho kong kailangan bumawi. So, medyo walang tinulog si ate girl. Ayun. Anyway, let me take you with me class it tayo together. Ayun. Anyway, ano oras na ba? 
it's 7.35. Um, my classes will start at 8 a.m. And, nagbabasa pa ako. Mga pahabol na basahin. Baka meron pa ako mga limutan. Nagtitake note pa ako. Mga bagay-bagay. Ayun. See you. Sa aking klase. Let me take you to my classes today. Mm, my lecture. Lecture notes. Medyo marami. Ito pinakahuli ko nang binasa kagabi. And here's my codal. Ayan o. Revised Penal Code of the Philippines. And here's my tablet. Just in case kailanganin ko siya for my readings. I got my highlighter. I got my ball pen. And ito, essential. Hmm. Ayaw mo mag-focus. Ayan. Hmm, essential. May mga pang haplas haplas ko sa noo ko kapag nag-aaral. It's a need. It's a tita need. Ewan ko, siguro yung mga law student din talagang mahilig dito. Bagong packaging na to ng spa essentials eh. Anyway. Ayun. Yun lang naman. Ganito yan. O, oh, ito. Diba yan? Open natin. Ganun. Ganon. Dinemo ko pa. Gusto niyo yun. Gusto ko din yung ano nito. Yung orange. Yung amoy bubble gum. Meron eh. Meron akong amoy na ganun eh. Na ganito. Yung bubble gum. Anyway. Bye. Oh, Tita May, hi ka sa vlog! Tita May, hi ka sa vlog ko! Hello! Uy! Miss Congeniality ka dyan! <laughs> vlog to vlog! Hi! Sa vlog ko! 
Ako vlog ako eh. Ay! Oh. Daig ka! Ay! Yung makahay siya. Grabe. Ang rito oh. Ito na ito. Okay. Merry Christmas! Pasko na. Hi Santa!